They're not exactly household names, but in Aboriginal communities across the top end, these guys are the headline act. Uh, they are hugely popular, they're superstars. I'm pretty, pretty popular now, like we, we, need, we are the, the biggest band in the Northern Territory. Oh, yeah. Performing together since they were teenagers, the Lonely Boys have finally produced an EP, recorded in a Gold Coast studio with feature single, The Hunter. Yeah. I'm a hunter, like, I, I, I have that spirit in me, like, me, I'm a proper bush black fella. Most of those boys will be functionally illiterate, but in music they are completely literate. And the great thing is, they can go to a major festival, stand next to Paul Kelly or anyone, and be equals, which is a rare thing in their lives to stand next to a white fella and feel like they're, they're actually their peer. Next month in Darwin, the Lonely Boys will have their biggest opportunity to impress so far. We're going to be supporting of one of the biggest men in the world. Um, yeah, I don't know what's that band called. I forgot the names. We're playing um, um, Queens of the Stone Age. Queens of uh, Queens of Stone Age. It's the band. I think, yeah. I never even heard of them. Um, the reason why we haven't heard of them because we, the band from the bush. <laughs> <laughs>